Let's take a brief look at the oscilloscope probe, a passive probe. This is a BMC adapter. And the probe identifies rings. This one is ground lead. And uh, this is sprung hook. We could take it off the probe. Here we also have prop tip ground adjustment tool and IC tips insulator. All passive oscilloscope probes must be properly compensated to produce accurate waveform monitoring. This is required for both analog oscilloscopes and digital storage oscilloscopes. Compensation is required to properly match the input impedance of the oscilloscope's vertical input channel circuitry. This input impedance is typically 1 mega ohm shunted by a small capacitance. The oscilloscope probe contains a variable capacitor that is used to turn the probes and distributed capacitance to match the input impedance of the score. Failure to properly adjust this capacitor could result in distorted waveforms and incorrect measurement values. Most oscilloscopes contain a compensation output signal that makes probe compensation simple without requiring any additional equipment. The probe is connected to either one of the input channels of the oscilloscope and the probe chip is then connected to the compensation signal. Any peaks or rounding of the waveform display indicate an improperly compensated probe. Let's have a look on the scope display. So channel 1 with form here is under compensated, and channel 2 is over compensated. Now we're using adjustment tool to adjust the probe compensation capacitor to make it properly compensated. <laughs> 